What's up, it's Bloom's Plant Vlog. Trying to give you a late fall update on my elephant ears, elephant ear plants, and let you know how they did this summer. I haven't given any update on this guy since last, since June, about June. So it's been a long time. I got to tell you everything what happened to why it looks so small. So the plant it look, is smaller now. It makes no sense, right? Well, let me explain what happened. It got really hot and dry in late summer. And the original plants, the original leaves, all died and shriveled up to a crisp. And then these are all new, new, basically new, all new plants. All the old plants died because of the heat. They just shriveled them all up and they pushed out new um, growth. And that's what this is. So the small now, but it's really cute. I like them. It is late fall. And since they're underneath the tree, they got frost protected. And they look healthy. We've already had near freezing temperatures already, and they're flawless. Unlike the bananas, which already got damaged by the frost a little bit, these are protected by the tree and have no frost damage. So that's the perks of having plants underneath, uh, tropical plants underneath uh, taller plants, because it protects them. But yeah, it's really cute. I like it. It's a nice little, a uh, nice little, um, like low lying this isn't supposed to be a low lying plant these get pretty big they were it's sort of like five feet before it kind of died almost but since it's cold it's not growing much new leaf pushing right there uh but other than that it's done it might it might last till late december we're gonna have a really 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 warm december the bananas all the tropicals will be outside through late december probably because we're going to be in the low 50s for December, which is ridiculous uh, for the low temperature because normally our average low temperature is 36. This time of year, our low temperature right now is in the 40s and 50s. So we're having very mild temperatures, which is a plus for the tropicals. Not so great for the peach tree because it needs chill hours to fruit next year. So if we don't get like chill hours, it's not going to flower. But for the tropicals, they're happy. They're loving it. Bananas get to be outside. The pineapples and the elephant ears, the colocasias, uh, get to be outside. So, very happy about that. So, that's about all to say about this. By the way, if this was last year, we had our first freeze, um, December the 1st. And um, we're not going to have our first freeze for the foreseeable future. It's really mild. So, we're kind of an extended month of tropical plants so that's exciting all right guys see you in the next one